things like nerves holding you back when you're up there because I know you know just how much potential and how much you have to give vocally and as an artist which you are so hungry to be so which is why um, when you're in rehearsals with Joey I think and I'm sure Joey will agree the most important thing for you and him to work on one-on-one -on -one is really getting you to the point where you feel comfortable up there because once you reach your full potential we'll get to see exactly what you're capable of and I know from what I've heard of you outside of this that's something special. Well done. Yeah. I've got to say this, the transformation that you have gone through confidence-wise in the past three weeks is insane to me because before this you you were contemplating not even entering in the first place. And now look where you are. You're on the stage, you sung you've sung songs, you've gone through three rounds that I you wouldn't be able to get to where you are now had you not applied. And I'm so, so, so glad and proud that you have <laughs> done what you've done. Um, you got into it a lot more, I thought. I thought you were a lot more comfortable up there and you got lost in the music. And, and that's a trait that I, I just love. But <laughs> you got into it and considering where you were before the process, wow. Uh, it wasn't as vocally strong as last week. There were a few pitching issues, but they could easily, you know, they could easily be worked on. And there were other areas that were drastically improved. So you could be really, really proud of that. Well done. And yeah. You definitely did take a different approach to that song than most people do, and I really like that. Because I like that you don't sing it the way everyone expects it to. I like how you sing it, the way you take it, the way you want to sing it, and I, I love that. Um, I also like the light and shade in there, where you were like nice and soft and subtle, and then you came out and you pull on, you give the power that it needed, and then you went back to your soft, and I love how easily you kind of done that. It was, it was lovely to see. The only thing I say to work on is that tiny bit of pitchiness, honestly, I think that's due to nerves. As soon as you brush them away, you are going to be unstoppable. You're going to be doing even higher songs, you're going to be taking even more risks, you're going to be adding riffs here and there. It's just them nerves. You need to believe in yourself, so because you have got a voice. There is so much potential there. I just really want to see you now next week. Bring yourself out a bit more. You need to believe in yourself because you're an amazing singer. All of us know that, and so do you. You just need to, that little push. But other than that, I really loved your performance, and I think it was one of your best. Well done. So, um, Sophie, what you just showcased to us there was that the, the fight in the vocal. Um, one, the only thing we're missing, like I said, you is, for me personally, I don't find you a, a nervous person in that sense. Um, you know, I've worked with so many nervous people and I've seen people crumbling and I don't get that with you, but the only thing I get with you in River Cells is that self-doubt of, I can't hit the notes. That's what I get. Um, and that's what holds you back a lot on that stage because, you know, you're quite a chatty and quite a comfortable person with people and things. <coughs> so this isn't a necessarily a, a confidence issue, it's more of a, a belief sort of issue, you know? Um, and that's what I was gonna say was that all we need to do, because you've done that, you was like that in, in the week, like doubting yourself on the notes, and you've come up here tonight and you just threw them out. You was throwing them out and it wasn't vocally perfect, it wasn't perfect, but my God, to see you actually having the guts to even attempt them is such a massive step up. And uh, all of you are on different journeys in this. And your journey, like what I'm seeing of you so far, it, it is baby steps, but it is definitely improvement happening. So just keep doing what you're doing. The only thing I wanted to take on because I wanted to do this because I want to see a little bit more courage and a bit more fight, even more. Because I believe that's what's pushing you vocally and taking you to another place. It's just, um, keep pushing yourself, and in rehearsals, when we're in rehearsals, you have that five minute doubt, but when you get up there, give it everything you possibly can. Because the, the sooner you get comfortable with allowing your voice to come out, the more confident you're gonna get as a performer on stage anyway. You know, so that's all you need to keep doing. Well done. Well done.